So some big breaking news, Mad Max just signed with the New York Mets for three years, $130 million. So he will likely retire in New York for the Mets, but he is getting paid bank for the rest of his career, possibly the rest of his career, just depends on if he stays healthy and efficient. Also other news, the Tampa Bay Rays just signed Brooks Raley on a two year, $10 million contract. A good pitcher for their bullpen and hopefully that helps because the Rays definitely need it just in case of injuries and stuff like that. He did spend some time with the Houston Astros, so we will see what he does with the Rays. Also, Chris Taylor might be signing with the Miami Marlins. They are reportedly interested in him. They are also interested in Kyle Schwarber, so we'll see who they get or could they get both of them. I say go after both Chris Taylor and Kyle Schwarber. That would help them a lot. Also, something that I found pretty cool is Reggie Jackson signed a five-year, $3.5 million contract in 1976. So that's pretty insane when you see guys like Mad Max signing three years for $130 million. And just years ago, Reggie Jackson, five years for $3.5 million. It's crazy how times have changed and people are getting paid way more. And I guess you can say that about any job nowadays. But anyways, that's it for this news video. Just thought I'd make a quick video. I'm inside my room, not in my office right now. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe down below for more free agency news and baseball news in general. And let me know, do you think that deal that the Mets just made was good? And do you think that will help the Mets? Let me know by dropping a comment down below. And other than that, I will catch you in my next one.